What's going on guys? So it's been a little hectic here lately. Um, holidays, Christmas, all that stuff coming up and with work and oh my gosh, I had to do the annual report and all kinds of stuff. So I'm just now getting caught up. I've done a few things here and there and oh man, this has been crazy. It's Wednesday night. I was sitting there on the couch and I was like, you know what? I just want to go out. Kingsport has some really nice Christmas lights up right now. I just want to go shoot some black and whites downtown uh, Kingsport. So it's about 11 o'clock at night and on a whim, I'm just like, let's go see what we can capture. So Jody's heading to bed and I'm heading out to take some shots. It's been raining for a solid week. Oh my God, pouring. And we got a break tonight. It's getting foggy, the Christmas lights. It should look pretty decent down there. So I'm hoping, 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 hoping we catch some. Um, yeah. But this is just going to be a quick, short video. Haven't put a video out in a couple weeks. It's, I'm like, ah, oh, i got to get something out there. And as I was sitting there dwelling on it, I was like, I'm going downtown Kingsport. So that's where we're going. We're going downtown Kingsport, Tennessee. We're going to get some black and whites. Hopefully have some good Christmas decorations with the, with the downtown. It's going to hopefully look good. Hopefully. I'd like to find a rain puddle, get a cool shot. I don't know. I have to wander around and see what we can find. But right now, the game plan is to head downtown. And just see what we can find. I have a fixed 35 millimeter lens with me in the car, f1.8, and I've got my 17 to 55 2.8 lens on there right now. Honestly, that's probably what I'll leave on there. Um, walk around with my tripod and shutter release and see what we get. All right, guys, let's head downtown. All right, so tonight's been a lot harder than I thought it would be. I'm set up here to do a, doing a vertical. Got some nice lights, nice reflections, Emporium sign, looking pretty good. But yeah, I've been wandering around here for a few minutes and uh, it's like every time I go find something, there's something that takes away from it and distracts me. So this is probably the first shot I actually really, really like. So, gonna try to see what I can come up with here. Okay, so I'm really liking this scene here. I've skewed up a little bit. I'm shooting horizontal now. And I'm getting a lot of this nice stuff in here. The scrunch is a play they got going on here. And yeah, it's working out really nice. Kinda see how I've got it framed up there, but really really liking this the mood is just crazy right now perfect night to go out and it's like 60 degrees too which is really odd all right and we'll get back to shooting okay so here's another shot i'm really loving i'm shooting a vertical got the emporium sign kind of working the subject around and seeing how it looks on every angle but yeah, I like this shot a lot too. Really nice night to be out. So I'm set up shooting this scene here. I really like the Pepsi machine and the way it glows under the glass and contrasts with the colors. This may be a color shot actually. So I'm gonna have to look at it when I get back home. Okay, this is another really good shot I found. Literally right behind where I was, I turned around and I really like how the uh, the package and the snowflake worked out here with these lights in the State Theater. It's a really cool shot here. Another color shot I really like too. Uh, I may have to put a comparison up. Color and black and white and you all tell me what you like better. Hard time deciding here. Okay, so I'm set up shooting a vertical here and I'm having to shoot it this way because there's a bunch of wires over here that don't look too good. And I'm framing it in with the tattoo parlor here. So, I'm not sure how I feel about this one, but I took it. So, we'll see how it comes out at the end. Well, I'm wandering around and not finding much of nothing I like right now. I thought maybe about shooting the Blakely Mitchell, but ah, just not feeling it. 
and I tried to do something over at that star and yeah I'm not feeling that either I don't know just not working out so we'll see just kind of wandering around at this point hmm so I'm a little bit up from the Blakely Mitchell down there and I kind of like the scene mm. I don't know not sure yet but I like the lights I like the reflections I like the fog we'll see it may work out but yeah I'm just slowly walking around I'm not gonna photograph this but I really like the window display Jody has one of those trees she just bought really cool one thing too like I don't get creeped out too often I'm kind of creeped out <laughs> not from like people or anything but just I don't know I got a weird vibe pretty creeped out it might just be the fog I don't know but yeah kind of eerie down here when you get the lights I don't know I just feel like something's watching you, which it could be, I mean, really it could be, but I don't see them. Hmm. I've always really liked this antique sign here. Me and Jody shop at this antique store all the time, but this, this one antique sign, I've always loved it. And this is actually the first time I photographed it, so I think I like this scene a lot, actually. I think it's coming out pretty good. Yeah, this is a bit crazy. Check this out. All kinds of decorated trees. I'm guessing for a cause because each one has a sign. Pretty cool. They do something like this in Johnson City at their park. So I wonder if this is the first year here or what. I don't know. I'm trying to frame up something right here. We'll see if it works. I don't know. This is one of those I'm bored. I'm going to take the shot kind of shot. Really shouldn't be doing it. It's a waste of time, but I'm going to try. Yeah, so that was a waste of time to photograph, so I know none of them came out how I like them, so we're just going to skip that. Hey guys, so I just pulled into the driveway. I'm done for the night. I looked around some more, didn't find anything I liked. I was like, you know what, it's getting late, I gotta go to work in a few hours, it's time to go home. But I hope you like these images, I'm putting them at the end of the video. Um, yeah, I got some shots I'm pretty happy with. I'm really glad I went out. The fog added so much to it. And I knew it was going to be that way. I knew it was going to be foggy. Didn't find a lot of puddle scenes that I really liked. Because they just didn't line up with the buildings on where they dipped and stuff. So that didn't work out. Maybe if I was walking around during the day and people were walking and stuff. I would have got something I'm happy with. But the way it was tonight, I didn't find any I liked. So I hope you love these shots. I got some black and whites. I'm going to put some color with them too. You let me know which one you like better. The black and white or color. Yeah, and if you've not subscribed, please do so. It helps me out a lot. It's free, doesn't cost anything to do. And if you want to see these pictures in more detail, go to my Facebook or my Instagram. Links are in the description. Yeah, just let me know what your favorite is. If you like the black and white, you like the color better. Um, had a great time walking around. Sometimes you just got to go. And this was a spur of a moment thing, and I just wanted to go get out and just do something. Get some shots. It's been a little bit, so I'm going to keep these videos going. Probably be a couple weeks before I put another video up, so I hope you like this. Again, check my Instagram out. I'm going to be putting a lot of shots up. There's a lot of shots that don't make it in the video that go up, and I do that kind of on purpose, so it gives you something to come back for. Um, but yeah, hope you all like it, and we'll catch you next time. Don't forget to subscribe. Subscribe. <laughs> Later, guys.